They've become a reality of our everyday life. Drones are taking over the skies, and one flight school in Johannesburg has started Africa's first drone university. In 2015, the country's Civil Aviation Authority imposed stringent regulations on drones. The Civil Aviation Authority does not allow you to fly a drone commercially unless you have a remote pilot license. We ourselves have trained in the last year and a half over 400 drone pilots. To get a remote pilot license, or as we know it as a drone license, you come in for training. Um, the theory takes about seven days. You pass your exams. You then go on to the practical training. The practical training is dependent on your own skill. Demand for commercial drone pilots is increasing. And although it can be a profitable profession, it comes at a cost. It costs between $1,500 to $2,000 for a student. Obviously, you need to get your medical, a civil aviation medical. You need to get your radio telephony license. It's a restricted license. You need English language proficiency. But the cost doesn't seem to be deterring those who are betting on a new career. As a cinematographer, I, I, I need to, there, there are places where I can reach with a camera or it gets expensive now using a real plane. So uh, it's, a, it's a cheaper way to get a bird's eye view with the drone. I'm investing in this for the future, for commercial gain. And uh, now this is the future now going forward in terms of filming. For me, having the license would benefit me for my uh, job that I'm doing currently. And without a license, you will not be able to fly uh, a drone. Whether we like it or not, drones are providing innovative and often life-saving benefits in diverse industries. That aircraft we normally use for big operations, for instance, like we did in Shislui. We did it for anti-rhino poaching, we could use it down there. The thing is, we've got a lot more endurance on this type of aircraft, we can stay in the air for longer and we get a bigger field because we can go up higher. It's all about aviation safety, and Africa's first drone university will be standing by with controller in hand, teaching the next generation of ground pilots. Julie Shara, CGTN, Johannesburg, South Africa.